okay today I'll take you to the process of clipping or how to use the vector tool in a clipping process so in order to do this first you drag the Songkhak shape files or you can double click on Songkhak shape files after that you select the Songkhak you want to so you can select the Songkhak by clicking on this just click and then select so the Songkhak would be selected this selection can be done in other process also if you click on this you can choose the Songkhak so for example like I want to choose this um, Tashikang so click on number 16 so Tashikang Songkhak would be selected so next process is what you can do is uh, go to vector then geoprocessing tool then click on clip then check the selected features only then click on these three dots then save to file then try to keep the name so we'll keep it as Tashkong Tsongkok then save then run the process after that you close it if you uncheck this you'll have the map of so you can remove this Songkhak now to remove this just right click and then remove the layer ok next what we will do is we will try to insert the Geok shape files on the Tashkan Songkhak shape files so double click on some Geok shape files if it's not in the center use your palm and then try to bring it in the center ok next what we will do is again you go to vector geoprocessing tool click on the clip then this time you use this as Tashkong Songkhok again click on this dot try to give the name save to file and then give the name geoks of Tashi Tashkong then save and try to run ok then close then if you uncheck this Tashkang Songkak and Kyok you'll have the Kyok map of Tashkang so you can remove these two process also if you don't want now what we'll do is we'll try to insert the names of Kyoks in Tashkang so double click on this Kyoks of Tashkang go to level make it a single level go to buffer check this draw text buffer then click apply then ok so we have a map showing the names of Tashkan Geok enlarge it ok now let us put different colors for different Geoks so in order to do this again click on Geoks of Tashkan double click then go to symbology try to make it as categorized choose this value as Geok name then choose a color ok you can classify click on classify then apply ok so you have a different color for the names of Geoks in Tashkang
now in order to make it as a final map go to project new print layout then keep the name then ok then add item add map in a similar process like a previous lesson just drag and release then you try to insert the legend north arrow scale and then title of map so in this similar process we can develop the map of uh, map like a river system, settlement, population map of East Songkhak. Thank you.